Yo, it's Chicken Bacon, Connor here, and today I'm going to go over how to enable SLI on H1Z1. So by default, it only runs one graphics card, but when you enable SLI, it actually doubled my performance, and uh, hopefully it can do the same for you. So first things first, we're going to make sure SLI is enabled, so right click and go to your NVIDIA control panel, then click on configure SLI, and make sure it's set to maximize 3D performance so your SLI is enabled. Alright, next, we're going to need to find where your H1Z1 is installed. So right-click on H1Z1 in Steam, go to Properties, Local Files, and then Browse Local Files. And that will bring you into your H1Z1 folder. So go ahead and up here at the navigation bar. You're going on a click, highlight the whole thing, and cut it or copy it. It doesn't really matter, either way. Then you're done with Steam. You can go ahead and close it all down. And we're going to need a nifty program called NVIDIA Inspector. I'll have a download link to this in the description. Uh, it allows you to go into your driver profiles for your graphics card and uh, set how they operate. So, I'm going to go ahead and run NVIDIA Inspector as administrator. And then here on the right hand side, uh, you want to click this little wrench that brings you into the driver profile settings. Once you're in here, there's a big list in the top left. You're going to want to scroll all the way down until you find Planet Side 2. About here. And in Planet Side 2, you'll see in the graphics card profile uh, that it has SLI GPU count 4 and SLI predefined mode force AFR2. So, that's all good. But what we're going to do is add H1Z1 to the Planet Side 2 profile by clicking this little green A. It's a little green plus sign with an A right up top here where it says add application to current profile. Go ahead and click on that. Alright, then at the top here you're going to want to paste in your path that you copied from Steam and it will bring you to your H1Z1 folder. Then go ahead and just click on the H1Z1 application and open it and it will add it to your plant side 2 uh, driver profile. So you'll see here at the top in this little green bar it should say h1z1.exe, plantside2.exe, and a couple other things. So if you see h1z1.exe in the green bar at the top here, uh, you know it's been added successfully, and that's all good. So then go ahead and make sure in the top right you click Apply Changes. And then it will probably take a couple seconds, but it will add it to your graphics card profile. So go ahead and close it down. And now when we open up h1z1, uh, I'm going to show you my graphics card performance it goes, it went from 99% on one graphics card to nearly 100% on both, and it doubled my frame rate. So before I was getting about uh, 55, 60 frames a second while recording, and uh, we're going to see what I get now with SLI enabled. Alright, so now I'm in game, and as you can see in the top right, I'm getting upwards of 100, even around 80 frames a second at the lowest. So, it doubled my frame rate effectively while recording, and then as you can see on the left hand side of the screen, it's using both my graphics cards at around 90% usage. So this is definitely a huge performance increase uh, for anyone who has two uh, NVIDIA graphics cards and SLI. You definitely want to enable it. It will effectively double your uh, your frames per second. So if anyone has any trouble uh, getting the SLI to work, uh, go ahead and leave me a comment. I'll try to help you out as best I can. But do hope you guys enjoyed, and peace out.